Hey guys, I'm Pat Kelly. Okay, in this problem, they give us a sequence and they ask us, is it geometric? And if so, we're supposed to find that common ratio. In fact, that's the key. If it's going to be geometric, is there is this common ratio between consecutive terms. So it's exactly what we're going to check for. Uh, what we do is grab consecutive terms, so one right after the other. In this case, let's grab the three and the six and you divide them. If we're looking for a ratio, you want to think division. And I'm going to divide the later one divided by the earlier one. And if you're listening, I'm saying later uh, intentionally. Don't always think bigger. Don't think to grab the bigger one divided by the smaller one because the original sequence could go up, it could go down, it could go all over the place. So always the later one, the six up top, and the earlier one on the bottom, okay? Then do the division, six divided by three is two, all right? That tells me nothing alone. Now what you need to do is go to another pairing of terms. So let's grab the second and the third, in this case the six and the 12, and again the later, which is 12, divided by the earlier, the six. Do the division which is two, you start to get a warm and fuzzy feeling because those are the same numbers. That's great, that's what we're looking for. But they do give me another term. I'm gonna go ahead and check it. I like to be as sure as I can. So let's grab the next pairing, the 12 and the 24 in this case. The later number, 24, divided by the earlier number of 12. This is looking great. We also get a two. The fact that we got the same number for each division means that this sequence is geometric. Let's get an answer on this guy. Geometric? Yes. The second half of the question also said, if it's geometric, what is the common ratio? So we'll say yes, it's geometric with the common ratio, usually labeled with an R for ratio, is exactly that number that we got with each of the divisions. So R equals two, okay? There you go. Take the same approach with the other problems, but I'm not gonna do those for you. Go do them on your own.